Hang on a sec, chat. Would this be better if I stuck my ass over here? Cover up this thing? Which is better? Here? There? Here? Over here? Technically over here, right? Really? Middle? Like middle bottom? I've been, I've been leaning away from middle bottom lately, chat. Dead center? Got it. All right, here we go. All right, chat. Let's do these combos. So jumping HP. God damn, I missed it. Okay. Let's go back to the middle. <laughs> All right, let's see what the uh, trial set up for us. All right. He's a god. How could he do the hardest thing in the world on the first try? Oh, this is with any attack? I can do the close one? Cool. Yo, oh, so it wants me to lay one out first. Ay. Okay, so it's a drill after an EX Hado. Okay. Or whatever the hell is. Soul balls. No! Come back! I'm pressing the button! Come on! Jeez, you really can't, like, buffer that one in. If I mash it too hard, I'm getting super some weird thing. So do the satellite! Standing HP, uh, big ass HK. Wait, what? Standing HP, fireball forward HK, fireball back punch? Oh, oh, it wants me to, oh. Wants me to set it up first. Oh, oh God. This game is like preparing you ahead of what you're currently doing to do in the future ahead of what you're currently doing. <gasps> I can't take this! I gotta do the heavy That's too far away, man. Joink. Dang. How is it possible? Yeah, that combo is like the Street Fighter timeline. It doesn't make any sense. Going all over the place. Uh, stand HK counter. Fireball forward medium punch. And real lane. Joink. That looks really cool. Holy hell. That looks really cool. Crouch HK counter. Wait, what? Crouch HP counter. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. So fireball forward medium punch after that. Whoa. Okay, I get it. I get it. I don't get it. Cool. Holy hell. Yeah, her corner fi her corner fireballs are kind of like Guile. They she recovers so quickly after them as long as you get a good counter hit. I'm actually very impressed with the trials of the character. And we are just starting. Jump HP, crouch HP, EX fireball, uh, activate. Yo, what? Wait, wait, what? I activate after EX. Maybe you want to do this one? That's the middle one. This is the close one. No, oh, that's mid. And it, it blows up. This thing blows up like immediately. Okay. All right. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Maybe not big shits that early. Ha! Oh dang. Yoink! That's pretty dope. So V-Trigger activation at the start. Wants me to do some crazy horseshit counter. Ugh. Stand HP. Light fireball. Teleport. Wait, what? That combos into this? Okay. Yo. Yo. Oh my good god. Oh my god. Uh, and I got to teleport after that jump. Oh dear. Oh, 
it press neutral. No, no. Oh, damn. This character is nuts. Actually, super. Well, there's a reason why Rose has super cool trials, chat. Because they, they gave her some meat, right? They gave this character some meat. If all characters had interesting meat the same way that Rose does, yo, this game from the very start would have been a lot more, uh, a lot more accepting as far as the way characters were. Because a lot of the early characters in this game did not have this kind of meat. The beta version was more interesting than vanilla. Well, it was, I mean, I can tell you, the beta version of Street Fighter V was way more interesting uh, at the start. So Crouch MK starter, right? Activate into slide. What the hell? Oh, good. Fireball forward punch, Crouch MP, Fireball forward punch. Wow, okay, 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 okay. Let's just do this part. So, do I have to cancel the first hit? I do. And then I do fireball, forward, medium punch again. Okay, okay. And then I do slide again. Cool. Ooh, okay, I think I got it. I think I got it. There's the good stuff. My God, dude. Damn, that is super, that is super cool. Holy shit, man. So the, here's the crazy part, right? Here's the crazy part about Rose. They injected into this character alpha-isms that people were, were complaining about, right? The new mechanic ended up being a, a cool invincible backdash, right? V-shits. V-shift is actually a pretty good idea and it looks cool and it leads to some interesting situations. But a lot of people were saying, oh, they were gonna add a custom combo or something like that to add variety to the game. Instead, they didn't. They just gave Rose custom combos. This is, we're just giving her custom combos. Here you go. She gets it, right? And she's genuinely scary when she's in it. I've seen people use it for pressure and it's like a block string, dude. You have to deal with that shit the same way that custom combos worked in Street Fighter Alpha 2 and beyond. But I guess this works more like Ganajin, right? It feels like this is a bit more Ganajin-ish because it's hitting twice. Custom combos, you just destroy it like brrrrap and you have this preset sequence that just whoops their ass. Say hey, Enbu? Yeah, kinda. You know what? Yeah, I guess it is say hey, Enbu. It is like Yang Super a little bit more because all the specials and all the normals hit twice. And that's the whole point behind. Say hey, Enbu! So I gotta go. Eh, 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 eh. Okay. I gotta go. Eh, 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 eh. Jesus. All the stuff you can do with this is crazy. Okay. Oh, I have to do down. I have to do down HP. Okay. Oh, mash the hell out of it. Okay, here we go. No! Yeah! Well, the, this, this damage is not great, but holy hell, does it look cool. Damage is okay. That's because you're activating into it, but damn, that's fun. So just from her trials alone, Capcom has successfully taken a character that has been historically boring as sin gameplay wise. I know, I know I've said it before, but I'm saying it right now. They've taken a character that's been historically not super interesting. She's always been good, but not interesting, right? I'm not saying she's actually bad. She's been just historically very good in many of the games she's shown up in. But the way they've switched her around and the abilities they've given her, they turned this girl into like a Killer Instinct character. Modifiers and behind the back teleports, custom combos that have like 
literally probably hundreds of different options that you can do. If every character in this game played like the later season four characters and now both of the season five characters, good God, man. It'd have been, th this game would have been so much more interesting for those first, first few years. Uh, Rose is a character that I historically have like, okay, it's Rose, whatever, right? Dan is just really cool that he's here. I think all these characters are super fun and way more fun than they have any right being, which is nuts. Ken should have been the character that kept me in this game. And I always hoped that Dudley would make it and they would change, you know, kind of a new approach of Dudley from his Street Fighter 4 version. The issue is that they're doing this at the end of Street Fighter 5. My biggest worry, chat, my my biggest worry is that they're they're doing all this interesting shit with their characters finally in Street Fighter 5. And my biggest worry, because we are repeating history again, what happened at the end of Street Fighter 4? Does anyone remember? We were all looking to the future because we knew Street Fighter 5 was happening. And then Ultra Street Fighter 4 came out. They rebalanced stuff, they added a red focus, all this shit. And they were really spicing up the game in some ways. But they also added Omega mode and gave us crazy weird Ken kicks fireballs versions of every character in the game. It was like, yo, what? What the, is this a testing ground for Street Fighter V? Long story short, it wasn't. And Street Fighter V, when it eventually came out, was nothing anywhere close to what Ultra Street Fighter IV ended up being in terms of the way characters were, in terms of what Omega mode kind of was, where they were really switching shit up. It was not at all by the time Street Fighter V eventually hit store shelves in February of 2016. Let's check out Rose's story. At the risk of my life. What? She's only five foot ten. She looks like she's seven feet tall. To see one's fate. Wait, what? One must fight their future. Huh? Only one who can see their future can truly understand one's fate. We're just jumping right into this? Wait a minute, Minot! Sorry! Sorry, Minot. Okay, Minot, I'm gonna do some crazy shit to you, okay? What? <laughs> what? Okay. Hey, stop it. Hey, stop it. Okay. No! No, I want to do my crazy stuff. Okay. To see one's fit, one must fight their future. I can't read that. Master, you are so cool. You shouldn't only admire my words, but also concentrate a little more on your lessons, Manat. <laughs> yes, Master. By the way, what do you have planned for today? <laughs> Can you predict that? Ah, uh, you want me to practice fortune telling? Right. Hmm, let me think. Trap peas? No, I guess not. Tragedy? No, that's not right. Oh, it's travel, isn't it? Yes, correct. Oh, Master, are you traveling somewhere? If you have some errand, I can do it for you. No, Manana. This appears to be a matter that only I am destined for. I will be away for a while. Please keep an eye on things. Yes, Master. Have a safe journey. She's going Marvel versus Capcom. <laughs> have someone. Oh, no, she's just going to India. Oh, okay. A strange energy. Is that right? I am not yes. ready for Oro to sound like that an old man. man. has been destroyed, and the dangerous power has disappeared with him as well. But I feel something different. This is like... Hmm. Having lived a little longer than you, I can see beyond that which you cannot. No, no, he needs to sound like a weird chicken. I can say that this energy is not my bison's. Whoa. I don't sense any evil or imbalance, but on the other hand, I do sense vibrations that are one with nature. Do you feel it as well? I, yes, I genuinely disagree with how Oro talks. However, Sounds like Deckard Cain. overwhelming force of nature and very difficult for me to ignore, and that gives me pause. Now I understand why you came all the way here. You wish to challenge it. Yes. 
Are we gonna fight Oro? <laughs> I humbly bid you welcome, fellow Earthling. I represent the Earth and await your challenge. The source is the fool, but the wheel of fate has already turned. I must now ascertain. Ascertain this. Oh shit, he's jumping at me. He's acting like G. What? Nice. Uh, how do I set this up? Oh God. Let me take some of this. Ooh, okay. okay. All right, Jay. That is right, Earthling. I believe you now understand. You see who I am, and who you are, and what is to become of all of us. No, oh, this can't be. But it can. I'm sure you can see it in your mind's eye very clearly. You and I, and all the people of the Earth, where we are now heading to. It's not true. Because it's... Because it's... The end of everything. Uh-oh. My dear Earthling. My dear intelligent Earthling. The vision you just saw is undoubtedly the same vision as mine. It is our fate. The same fate as all my Earthlings. And the same fate of the entire universe. <gasps> The Great Reset? Despite appearances, I am not sure who he really is. However, the vision I saw after I battled with him was all too real. The world is going to end. As if a gigantic glacier fell into the ocean. And now, it's too late to find a way to stop it. Shadaloo and Bison. I believed if I could eliminate their evil, the world would be able to escape from crisis. I believed that, but was I too naive? Master, welcome home! <gasps> oh, Master, what happened? You look like you just experienced the end of the world! That face. Oh, Master looks terribly worn out. What can I do for her? That face. Ah, I know, a bath! Master, I'll drag you a bath! That face, though. My God. <sighs> Psycho power. Jesus! The abuse of such dangerous power. What is this? The Alpha Two the ending? The precipice of destruction. Maybe Alpha One. But even after that man's ambition has been crushed, we are still on the path of annihilation. The world had already been heading in the wrong direction long before I realized it. Now it's too late. The answer lies not in the future, but in the past. We must stop the seed of evil from ever taking root. What? And the only one who can do that is me. The me of the past. Only I have the ability to stop this. If the person I was could see into my mind right now and realize the situation. Wait. Yes, she's. I might be able to start. She's literally again. doing some MK9 Raiden shit? From zero. Oh, man. So you're telling me that Street Fighter V is fucked. We got to go back to Street Fighter Alpha and reset everything. That's what they're, I, I don't, mm, I wonder if they're hinting at the next Street Fighter game, possibly, right? Maybe the next Street Fighter game possibly goes back to zero. Ugh, man, that's a, that's definitely an interesting ending. But dude, they're literally doing exactly what Mortal Kombat 9 did.